Hi, this is Lonnie Barrett with EasyOrgSites.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use WordPress software to create your own content management system using freely available resources on the Internet. If you need a simple website that is easy to maintain, even by non-designers, then this may be just the thing for you. To take a look at the features that this website offers, uh, go on over to EasyOrgSites.com. And you can take a look at the video on the front page of EasyOrgSites.com to see the features that you can incorporate into your WordPress CMS site. Using WordPress as a content management system is one of the most frequently searched phrases on Google. In this video, we're going to create a website for the Oregon Connections Academy Key Club, otherwise known as the Orca Key Club. I've already purchased a domain name, orcakeyclub.org, to use for the website. And I have set up a web hosting account. If you aren't familiar with how to do those things, check out our FAQ link for more videos on how to purchase domain names, how to set up hosting, and how to configure other components of your WordPress CMS. The first step that we're going to take is to install our WordPress software. So we can go back to the WordPress website and we can click the download link. Or in my case, I'm going to go to my web server and install it directly onto the server using Fantastico. It's beyond the scope of this video to show you exactly how to install WordPress on your server. However, it's known as a fairly simple installation process. So give it a try and see if you uh, can't uh, do that successfully. And maybe one of these days, I'll get around to creating a video specifically for that. We're going to install the orcakeyclub.org website using the easyorgsites.com server. And we're going to log into the control panel. It's called cPanel. Where we will enter a username and password. And once in the control panel, we'll just click on Fantastico. Click on WordPress. And this will actually create the databases for us and do the complete installation of version 2.7 of WordPress. So it's a very easy solution for installing WordPress. Many uh, of the better servers will offer this service. Uh, so check with your server. They may offer this. And uh, if not, then you'll need to do a manual installation. We want to install this in the root directory, so we leave this first box blank. And then we're going to assign admin access data. We'll create the username admin and a temporary password, orca password. The admin nickname, orca key club. The email address is admin at orcakeyclub.org. I had already set that up. Site name. And then the description will do a little bit expanded. And then we click install WordPress. Click Finish Installation. And that's it. Now that we've set up our WordPress installation, we need to go to the admin control panel. So there's a link right here. We can just click. You'll go to orcakeyclub.org slash wp-login. And here we're going to enter our username and password. And we will log in. 
And here we see the dashboard for the newly created Orca Key Club WordPress site.